Hey guys, Trevor Duncan here with Cell Seattle and CellSeattle.com. I want to thank you for joining me on our YouTube channel. Today I'll be walking you through how to wipe your personal data off of a BlackBerry 8320. This one happens to be a T-Mobile BlackBerry, so that means it is a GSM phone and it has a SIM card. I'm going to recommend that you keep your SIM card in the phone during this procedure, then it can be safely removed afterwards. So let's go ahead and get started. First we need to unlock the screen. You can just press in your trackball. And here we can see the date and time and whatnot. Then we're going to press the menu key which is right here next to the navigation or the trackball. It looks kind of like a little bunch of uh, grapes. We're going to click that. That pulls up all of our different icons for the different settings here. And we're going to scroll down and over to the icon that looks like a wrench. Hopefully you could see that. Then we'll press the trackball to select it. This pulls up a menu that says options. Using the trackball, scroll down alphabetically here to where it says security options. Press the trackball to select that. Then at the top, it says general settings, and you're going to select that. Under general settings, you'll see lots of information about passwords and so on. Now press the menu key again. That's the one that looks like grapes. This pulls up a secondary menu and the second option here says wipe handheld. You're going to press your trackball to select that. Another page comes up reminding us, warning, all application data will be lost. That's good. We want to remove everything from the phone. In fact, I suggest that you scroll down once to this check box, check the box by pressing the trackball, then highlight continue and press your trackball to confirm. Now if you can see we're being asked to type the word Blackberry so we're going to type B-L-A-C-K-B-E-R-R-Y Once you've spelled out Blackberry you can press the trackball one more time. We now have a warning that information is being erased. Here you can see the status bar it says wiping this part happens pretty quickly. The actual full reset of the phone does take a few moments. And once the phone has been fully reset, then it's going to come to a screen that looks just like this. It says, Welcome. Roll the trackball to move the cursor. You have a couple choices here to run the setup wizard, which will walk you through setting up your email. We can remind later or you can tell it to never bother you about that again. Maybe you don't plan on using the phone for internet. You just like having a phone with a keyboard for texting. And then don't forget to go ahead and if you're going to be sending your phone in for any kind of replacement, maybe in exchange for insurance or warranty, remove your SIM card, memory card, and that will further protect your personal information. So I want to thank you again for tuning in. It's been Trevor with Cell Seattle. Please visit our website, particularly if you have one or more phones that you're interested in responsibly recycling. And otherwise, I just appreciate your time, and I hope you have a great day.